Good price, and he will be on the offense for Don't Care About Ice. And we're about to kick it off here. AKG in white. He'll be receiving ice in the dark green for the J-E-T-S Jets, Jets, Jets. And we are underway, and there's AKG putting on some moves. He'll start, though, around his 25-yard line. First and 10. And he's got a pass, and there we go. Hits Ryan the Shazier. linebacker. Ryan Shazier <laughs> playing tight end. You like that? I like that. You know what I mean? We, linebackers can catch, too. I know we take a lot of criticism. Sometimes a lot of a couple of us got four thumbs, but it's okay. I was about to say, some of you guys got hands like feet. <laughs> Derrick Henry running off the left side. Every time Joey I think about Bosa. Derrick Henry. Joey Bosa walking down, though. He did. Every time I think about Derrick Henry, I think about that shot of him in the national championship game with Mark Ingram sitting next to him, and Mark Ingram looked like a little kid <laughs> next to him. Man, that was crazy. No, but I met him when he was uh, receiving the Heisman. He came to the, to the NFL today, and I thought he was a defensive end. Dude, like 6'3", huge dude. A lot of Brandon Jacobs in him. A little bit more speed, though. Yes. Watch out on the left side there. And it's Reddick with the sack. So it'll be fourth down and 12. Did you see the emotion, yeah, emotion from the young early. kid? Don't care about ice. He's into it. He's into it. But I don't know if AKG got, by, got, by, got rattled by that. He still looks like he has a little confident smirk. Here's the fourth competitive Madden player. Fourth and 12. He's going for it. Wow. This is what they do. And he's got that gun trips with the tight end on the back side. Ron Shazier, fourth and 12. Aaron Rodgers looking. Steps up in the pocket and got a dot across the wow. middle there. Ah, with I Richardson. see the chatter. I see the chatter back and forth. This game is going to get heated. It is. Both guys chirping a little bit. I like it. Emotion, passion, enthusiasm. You got to love it. Rodgers back in that shotgun running away, and he throws it away wisely there. AKG will live to fight another down second and 10 Ice for bring, AKG. Bryce bringing a lot of pressure off the edge, bringing that hang defender that can't be accounted for. Especially when you have trips, you, you have a short edge. That's true. Second down and trip. I was about to say second down and trip. Second down and 10 with the trips to the left with the gun. Motion the rocket formation. Exactly. Stays in the pocket. Nice play Ryan call there. Shazier. Ryan Shazier coming across on that drag. Gain of about four. Third down and six for AKG. Third and six, midfield. Not going to see a lot of running in this game. Both of these guys really good airing it out. Totally different from that first game. Rodgers back to pass in the gun. He's got wide, looked at him, saw him. He's got Richardson. I think he came up about a half a yard short. Can we and it get will a measurement? Be fourth and inches. <laughs> Can we get a measurement? <laughs> fourth and inches, our second fourth down of the game. And unlike Madden 17, the quarterback sneak, not a given in Madden 18. Uh. I tell you what, Ice with this sink front, he, he doesn't have anybody off the edges at all. Kind of hard to sneak it when you're in the gun. He's back in his gun. Trips tight. What is he going to do here? Something short? Or will he pop him for something long? Oh, wow. Fumble. Fumble on doesn't the Doesn't matter who it's recovered by. It's first and ten going the other way. You just heard the emotion coming from the mouth of the youngster, the 18-year-old. Don't care about Ice. George Schwartz all the way here from Jim Thorpe. P.A. And he'll have the ball first and 10. I'm excited to see what this guy has on offense. And he's going to start once again. Very popular gun bunch. You'll see the bunch there on the right hand side. He's got Coleman off the left side. Got oh. on the right side. Breaks a tackle. Oh, he couldn't break that second one. Hits up. We'll give him nine on that one. Second and inches there. Gets near the 40. I like this. Two wide yeah. open offenses. And whoa, what about the confidence of the young kid, the 18-year-old George Schwartz? I tell you what, George Schwartz is playing. He's got a lot of swag, a lot of a lot of confidence in his game right now. And he's picking Coleman. up the first down and he's get these chains moving. He's on the 40-yard line in two plays. Two plays, two rushes, 11 yards, picked up nine and a half, and got another eh, one and a half, two yards there on the play back in the gun bunch got his quarterback Carson Wentz gonna motion Stefan Diggs to the right Wentz looking he's got oh, A or pass. B oh. oh he had B coming across there didn't have enough time to hit him Reggie White with the sack 
for you, AKG, second and 21, Bart. And that's on the quarterback. You got to make a quicker decision. You don't have a lot of time, especially you talk about Reggie White coming off the edge to make a decision. You got to make it quick. Second and 21. Ice back in that gun bunch. You got to try and get a little bit back. You can't try and get it all. Don't get greedy and make an early mistake. There it is. It's the receiver, Buchanan. It's going to be about third and 10. That's a manageable. Good job in getting some positive yardage so that you can have opportunity. Deion Buchanan, the middle linebacker, also playing on offense for Young. Don't care about ice. Third and 10 there. You're right. He got half of it back. Back into the gun bunch on the left side. Back, Coleman, offset to the right side. Carson Wentz in the gun. Play clock winding down. Third and 10. One thing about that bunch formation is AKJ is G is playing his, his playing his corners off. The edges are set. And it's going to be tough to try and get some outbreaking routes because he's sitting right there for the seven routes. Pass complete. Was that complete to Paul Richardson? It was either Richardson or Diggs. I believe it was Richardson, number 17. Actually, number 10. So it was out. Uh, back it was T.Y. Hilton. T.Y. That's what it was, 13. He has, I'll tell you what, Ice has speed all over the field. And if you give him time, these guys are going to are going to find the holes in his own. I like T.Y. Hilton came out of FIU, Florida International, in the Conference USA. Man, he used to give my team the business, Middle Tennessee, every time they played him. Really good receiver, doing great work at Indy now. There's Stephon Diggs with the dig route across the middle, no pun intended. Diggs <laughs> on the dig. A first down there for Ice, as you can hear him clapping in the background. AK I like it. Show him the emotion, huh? AKJ. G cannot give him that much time in the pocket. He's going to have to consider bringing some edge pressure as what happens is when you have a lot of these bunch formations, you have very short edges as the receivers. You can run outside of the receivers and it makes it difficult for the tackle to get back and locate the edge rusher. I don't know why you don't see a lot more people blitz out of the bunch. You talked yeah. about it, that short, that short edge there, right? Corner blitz, he can't get blocked because the receivers are all going off a route and the tackle is only told to take the bid. Coleman off the left-hand side. Three rushes, 11 yards on the day. Uh, I was going to say a gain of none yards there. Joey Bosa uh, making the tackle uh, for AKG. But you saw that first quarter flying by. Flying One by. possession. It's a possession game in competitive Madden. And you get these guys locking horns. Second and 10 inside the red zone for a young ice on the move. His first possession. And we're already into the second quarter there. Carson Wentz barking out the audibles. T.Y. Hilton in motion. All day to pass. T.Y. Hilton once again running across the zones and sitting down and hitting him on the other side. All it is, just drag routes and all of that good stuff. It's a lot of West, the middle. It's a lot of West Coast offense. You talk about West Coast offense getting the balls in the hands of your playmakers and, let, and allowing them to do work after the catch. A lot of yak in the West Coast offense. Third down and one for Young. Don't care about ice from Jim Thorpe, Pennsylvania. Uh, he just might have enough aggressiveness, aggressiveness inside of him that he might go for it if he doesn't get it. Seems like that's how he's playing. High There's formation. Tevin Coleman coming up short. Will he go for it? Here's a guy that talked about it. He said yes. He's High going formation. for it. He came to win. Like it. Didn't come all the way from Jim Thorpe, PA for nothing. He's going for it. He wants that free trip. All expenses paid. No, he is going to kick it. Uh, Fourth and one. He decides to go for the points. You know how many toes it is between here and Jim Thorpe? <laughs> a lot. I don't know how many, but I'm sure a lot. Field goal is up, and that is right down the middle. So this one drive, and it took about five and a half minutes on that first drive. He's got a 3 nothing lead. You got to consider that a bit of a victory, not giving up the seven points, still giving yourself an opportunity to get on the board before the half and maybe take the lead. Absolutely. Oh, great oh, move there oh. by AKG. He's got some space on the outside. Can't break that last tackle, I believe. Is that Paul Krause playing special teams with the one bar, saving the touchdown there. AKG almost had this game flipped on its head, but he'll have good field position with his first possession of the game here. Right Pretty back. much midway through the second quarter. Right back at you, AKG. Showing a little swag on, his, on the joystick. AKG oh. with Aaron Rodgers. 
I tell you what, you talk about these long, in-breaking, developing routes, you, you're leaving your quarterback out there for a while. You only can expect your offensive line to block for so long. As they like to say, man, uh, it doesn't matter how good the quarterback is, it's hard to complete passes on your butt, right? <laughs> Absolutely. Hard Once again, a long, in-breaking route. Ice playing a He's lot got of coverage. Him though. Toe drag swag, I believe that was complete, and it is. Aaron <laughs> Rodgers now five of six. 69 yards, AKG with the reception down the sideline, d -Jax. That was an amazing catch, understanding where the sidelines were, getting the toes down, maintaining possession throughout the catch. Derrick Henry, big man, getting vertical. Ooh, trucking a defender there. I believe it was Paul Richardson. Paul Richardson, get off the, the track. The train is coming through. Yes, good running there by Derrick Henry, the former Former Alabama, great road tied. We'll see if they get into their college football playoff. That's a big man. Yes. Up the gut. This is this is where it get, this is where it gets tough at because you want to play heavy against the run because now the zones are smaller because you don't have a lot of feel. Always like to take a shot at the high red. When you get into the low red, it gets a little bit difficult because you run out of feel pretty fast. And it was Paul Richardson on that long pass on the toe drag swag, but there's Derrick Henry. Does not get into the end zone. He's going to come up just a bit short as we hit the two-minute warning. Third and goal from about the one-inch line. AKG on the move, looking to take the lead here as we hit the two-minute warning in the first half here. Three-nothing lead for Don't Care About Ice, but AKG on the move, Bart. Don't care about ice, but you better care about this stop. Critical play here for both competitors here. AKG trying to get on the board and take the lead here. You just the second possession up. of the game. You just got to stand up. Oh, the toss sweep. Oh. I didn't like that. Oh, I didn't like that call. The toss sweep. Jadavion like Clowney there. again. Jadavion Clowney at the second level is difficult. He's tough. You're not going to run him over. You talk about Derrick Henry being a big man. Jadavion Clowney equally as big. Loss of about three yards there. So fourth and goal for AKG. Will he go for it or will he go ahead and take the points? Uh, he's going wow. for it. Wow. He's here to win. You talk about swag. He has belief. Here we go. Fourth and go. Drops back Aaron Rodgers. He's got a receiver. No, that was not in bounds. Out of Incomplete. bounds. Incomplete. Absolutely. Remember it was this. caught but not in bounds. Ball goes over to George Schwartz, a.k.a. Don't care about ice. Remember this. 146. Instead of tying it up, he decided to go for seven. It could come back to haunt him. There's Coleman off the left-hand side. We'll see if Ice can take this last possession and sort of ice the first half. And if he can drive and uh, maybe get a field goal or even a touchdown and get that two-score advantage. Second down and eight. Buck 30 to go here in the first half for Don't Care About Ice, the great defensive stand from that last possession. Got a receiver on the right-hand side. It's his linebacker, Buchanan. Going to come up about a yard short. Carson Wentz, perfect on the day. Six of six, 53 yards passing through the air so far for I'm Pennsylvania. Into, I'm interested in AKG is going to start using some of his timeouts as you look at, you know, one minute to go, roughly. Oh, not anymore. First down. Nice running Tough. there by Coleman off the right-hand side. Very popular player in Mutt, Madden Ultimate Team. Very affordable player that gets the job done. He can catch the ball out of the backfield. He can run hard up the gut through the tackles. And once again, Buchanan can't hold on to this one. First in completion of the day for Carson Wentz, Mark. Uh, Carson Wentz, 6 of 7 for 53 yards, and that's all he's needed so far. Let's see if he can mount something before the half. His time is starting to take away. Let's see if he takes a shot. Try to take advantage of something down the field. Wentz in the gun bunch. Oh, receiver coming off. Defender coming off the right side. He did get it off. Very close to a fumble there. Third down and 10. Good pressure by AKG. Third down and 10. AKG is going to have to call a timeout right after this if he gets the stop and has the opportunity to maybe get in field goal position and try and get a score. Got a receiver down the middle, and it's knocked down there by AKG. Now, does Ice punt? Absolutely. I think you have he's to. Not, he's, not, he's not that confident. We'll see. Yes, he is going with the special teams. He's going to trot out the punting unit there. So AKG will get the ball back, is likely that, here with about 35 seconds. Is that DJ back there? He's going to punt 
It's a lot of speed. Nobody on the gunners. That, that could be a pivotal mistake as those gunners get down there pretty fast. Short oh, putt there short as well. Putt. Oh, good move, good spin, but he's brought down. So he'll have the ball around his own 45. AKG, third possession of the game. And he's got 34 seconds and a full allotment of timeouts in his pocket, Bart. But I tell you what, a lot of guys say that they don't spend a lot of their salary cap on kickers. But you know, right now, you want to have a solid kicker like a Tucker. Like Blair Wash. Let's see if he can get a field goal range and have an opportunity to maybe attempt a field goal. And not, not the Minnesota Vikings, Blair Walsh, that missed that kick <laughs> against the Seahawks. And not the one that missed with the Seahawks last week. Okay, bad, <laughs> Sunday bad, night football. Bad, bad name. Let's go with Bailey. Let's go, let's go with Dan Bailey then. No, no, yeah. Get a, get a Bailey or somebody like that. A Prater. Maybe even a Gostowski. Still doing decent for uh, New England up the road there. About 20 second. yards to put him in field goal range. Pretty much second down and three for AKG. Oh, great route combination there. And he finds D Jackson, Deshaun Jackson off the left hand side. And that's a gain of about 15. First down for AKG. 24 seconds left. He has one timeout left around the 36 yard line on the move. He is in field goal range. I think maybe another five yards definitely is there. He's got an end breaking route coming in. He's got why. He's also got, oh, oh man. Oh, threw away. 17 seconds to go, one timeout, get a better play, got to get in a rhythm, call the timeout right after the play. He had a receiver flying up the field, down the sideline, didn't have enough time to find him. Aaron Rodgers, one of those only players that I can say can throw across his body. He can pretty much do anything he wants. And there is Tyreek Hill with the reception there. And it was Derrick Henry that was running down and screaming down the sidelines last time. He wasn't able to pick him up. But he does get the first down with Tyreek Hill. He's going to take his final timeout. Does ice try and ice? Sure, why not? AKG. He's got three timeouts. He's got two timeouts left. Go ahead and use one here. Two seconds left. AKG about to kick a field goal. 44 yards, we'll call it. Two seconds remaining. Kick is up. And, and it is. Oh, it just sneaks just through on the left did. side. And we will be tied at three going into halftime of the second semifinal here live at MetLife Stadium, the Toyota Club of the Madden 18 Jets Championship presented by Reach NJ. Larry Ridley on the call with Bart Scott. Can't wait. The Mad Backer can't wait for this third quarter to get started here, Bart. Ice receives, starts ice. off with a fair catch. Getting the ball on the 32-yard line. Here we go. Tied up. A lot of action, but still not a lot of points being scored here. Waiting to see someone break out and show the offensive firepower that we're used to seeing. Everybody's playing the sticks. Everybody's playing coverage deep, trying not to give up the big play. At the little slant route to the left side, Stefan Diggs can't hold on to the ball. AKG a little motions there. I, I hear the trash talk coming. Both guys showing some fight. Knowing what's at stake here, a trip to the championship game and a matchup with franchise in front of his friends and his uh, friends and his family nice crossing around good positive yards going to have a manageable third down third and five good play T.Y. Hilton I'm looking at the yards per attempt and he's got 11 attempts only 59 yards a lot of Deacon and Duncan right now with both of these quarterbacks. A lot of horizontal routes. I'll be, I'll be interested to see what defense decides to put a robber coverage in there to kind of take away those dig routes. Good move by T.Y. Hilton. Yeah. Catching it on that in-breaking route. A little bit more there. Gain of about 15 there. First and 10. AKG on defense. Ice on the move. Ice once again in the dark green. The green jerseys. AKG in the all-white. There's Coleman running on the right-hand side. Not a lot doing there. Give him about a one-yard gain, a gain of actually none. Second down and 10 for Ice. I tell you what, I think the first player to start putting even a robber coverage or dropping that linebacker there, you can get an opportunity for a big play, maybe an interception. Back to the gun bunch. Got a receiver, Hilton. Once again, on the catch. Dig gain again. of about eight. Sure was. Third down and two. We see what the game plan is. Crossing routes and, and digs and slants. You're giving what the defense is taking, giving you. You got two deep safeties. You know, it's a space right behind the linebackers as the high linebackers getting caught up in play action, not really getting linebacker down. Oh, and there we go. Don't go there. The bullet pass picked off by Derek 
Brooks. That's how you play that old Tampa 2 right there. Get that linebacker underneath the coverage. Great job there by AKG. I think AKG was listening to Mad Backer. <laughs> sure was. AKG with the ball now. Tied at three. Oh, Derek yo, Henry. Try the old power. You don't see that too often in this spread offense type of world anymore. A pulling guard. Wow. Haven't seen that in a long time. Yep. The old ISO. The old student body. <laughs> that USC used to run back in the day. Ryan Shazier getting a lot of work. I know it. He's got, he's got to be tired playing offense and defense. Second at nine for AKG. He's got a receiver ball. Richardson on the left side. Very short game there. Game of about four. Call it third and five for AKG. Live here for the Madden 18 Jets Championship presented by Reach NJ. Larry Ridley, Bart Scott here live inside of MetLife Stadium in East Rutherford, New Jersey. Second semifinal between AKG and Ice. AKG with the ball. Hits the receiver once again, Deep Jets. Another very short game. Game of about two. We'll call it fourth and two. Actually give him three on that one, Bart. A lot of horizontal stuff. Yeah, man, I tell you what, you really want to capitalize off the turnover. But, if you know, you have to give um, a lot of credit to Ice if he's able to, after a big turnover, to be able to get the ball right back. So here we go again. Our fourth, fourth down of the day. Fourth and two for AKG. Gun tight. Fakes it to Derrick Henry. He's got Y. If he hit it, it would hit him. And there it is. Nice little pass to Paul Richardson. He finally caught him almost. Waited a little too late. I tell you what, man. If, if any one of these guys make the adjustment and just have a, a robber coverage just sitting in the middle of the field, every completed ball today has been a horizontal route. Right on cue, right? Horizontal <laughs> route, horizontal route. Whoever decides to put that robber in the defense that can grab that crosser, he's going to have opportunities here. Or how about you be the user and use your linebacker? I mean, these guys have some really good linebackers. We just saw Derek Brooks get one. Uh, that's where he can make some hay there. Fast half, too. You're talking about one, about 140 to go in a half. Somebody's going to have to take control of this football game. Derek Henry's trying to do that. Way to take the big man legs out. If you can't take him up top, take him down low. Chopping wood, baby. There's Paul Krause with the elbow pass, pads, and the, the single bar. I'm all about that uh, Rydell life. We used to call that the moon face mask, right? <laughs> Get your nose broke. I know it. Third down and two for AKG. Isn't that gun tight? Shazir in the tight end formation. Derrick Henry offset to the right-hand side. Fakes it to him. Rodgers looking. He's got a receiver. And there he does. He hits Tyreek Hill across the middle. Aaron Rodgers pretty productive today. 12 of 15, a buck 35. AKG. On the move, a fresh set of downs, Bart. AKG, he's using half of the field. He's bringing all his receivers to him, flooding the zones, hitting the ball, throwing the ball across his body. He's bringing the guys from the boundary, from the wide side of the field, to him. Once again. Good job hitting Shazier. He had Shazier, but he had more. He did. First down and 10, but he's on the move. Trips into the boundary again. Derrick Henry all set. Gun tight. Derrick Henry offset to the right hand side. Sink front, no edges. The edges aren't set. All the linemen are in tight. That is a light box. Maybe he audibles to a run here. I think he got down. There right. it is. There's the draw. Just like we called for. Probably had a little more room on the right hand side. He's probably still running. This is, why I'm saying that's a, nine. this is why I'm saying that's a bad call. You're in a sink front. You got the edges. You're blocked down. You got a nice toss to the right. You already have an offset back. He doesn't have a defender anywhere in sight. So you have the down block. So you're coming out of that gun trips with the tight, right? The old school Giants toss to Ahmad Bradshaw offset. That's it. But it looks like he's running a little more of a halfback draw. That's the call right, for him out of that formation. See, but the draw takes time to develop. It does. You want a quick hit in play to get to those edges fast, much like the first game when you had the franchise running the boss with Bo Jackson. The edges are open and available. Good point there. There's AKG, the baby face assassin, 6'7". You see the young man when he walks into the room, 20 years of age, from the Bronx. 
loves the Jets, favorite team. AKG told us, uh, it was pretty cool, he tweeted it as well, first time ever at MetLife, and he's thankful that it's all because of a video game, so that's pretty cool. How about EA Sports, Madden NFL, and the Jets coming together to make the dream come true for AKG, first time ever at an NFL stadium, his favorite team's NFL stadium here in East Rutherford at MetLife Stadium. Third down and six, what do you do here if you're AKG, Bart? Well, you back it up and you're going with the old faith when you won't be crossing the there. And he scrolls it through. Ooh. Ryan Shagir making a huge play. Way to thread the needle, AKG. AKG just belting out some noise there, showing some emotion. This is not, this is unlike AKG. I've seen him in plenty of tournaments, usually pretty reserved. But today, maybe it's because he's in the. It's the moment, baby. He's in MetLife Stadium. That's what it is. And he's got fans who's excited about it. I want to thank all of the Jets fans for coming out. Got the, uh, the kids up front. Go ahead, guys. Give us a J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. Can we get somebody? Do, do I need to lead it? Can we get one? Second down and goal for in. AKG. And there it is, the quarterback, the quarterback sneak. sneak. Not as potent as it was in Madden 17. Third and goal for AKG. Time ticking away here in the fourth quarter of a 3-3 ball game. You have to finish if you're AKG. You have to finish. On a one-yard line, you got a 260-pound back. If he kicks a field goal here, he loses the game. He has to get seven here. Absolutely. This is very pivotal. He goes, oh! Oh, stacked up. Great job there by Ice. Defense looking good. Buchanan and those guys playing very well for him. Up the gut, and AKG will go for the short field goal. 19-yard field goes up and good. He's up 6-3. But if you're ice, you feel like that's a huge win for you. And you have, you have to be encouraged saying, hey, I can go down and tie it or win the game. Go for the, the go-ahead score, and he's focused. Locked in is going to start with this kickoff. Make sure you get good field position. AKG's been doing sky kicks, so it should give you about the ball at about the 30-yard line. Let's see what he does. Another sky kick, as you said, we'll get it around if the 20. you let that thing go out of bounds, it'd be a huge mistake. Uh, okay, Stefan Diggs does decide to pick it up. <laughs> so he's going to get back into his gun. Gun punch guy. I got to check the G-Mat at the stadium, man. That, that, that ball didn't have a lot of spring to it. 81-81. Gun bunch, very popular formation for Madden 18. Or Dubby, the needed crew. and Oh, he picks up the blitz. Oh, got a man open. That's going to be out of bounds. But what, like we were saying, that gun bunch made very popular by a needed crew with Dubby and Skimbo and those guys doing a great job uh, leading the way, a very popular formation. Also, the gun trips tight as well. So we're seeing a lot of that with these competitors today. Second and 10 Clean from Ice. Pocket. Got plenty of time. Takes off with Carson Wentz. Make sure you get down. Uh -huh. I don't want to fumble there. The we mobility. saw that last week in Seattle. You got to love the mobility of Carson Wentz. He's been a true competitor all season. It's reflecting in his play. Salary cap number. I can't still believe it's almost 60. That's a lot for a second year guy. Well, you know, he's, he's in the running for MVP, so they're going to put that premium price on. It's like buying M&M's from the airport. You're going to pay a luxury tax. <laughs> That's a good point. There will be a luxury tax there. First down and 10. Carson wins he's, plenty of time. He's got time he's to got run again. X. Oh, he takes off. Oh, you better get down. And that's the hit stick. Oh. But it is recovered. Get, get up, Craig. Get up, Craig. I've been down before. That's what we were talking about. Be careful. He had X coming across <laughs> on the dig. But he decided to take off. And he's fortunate that he's able to recover that second down and one for ice. He might just let this thing tick all the way down to the two-minute warning and pretty much collect himself. We might have to put Carson Wentz in the protocol. He almost went night-night. <laughs> oh, we hit the two-minute warning right now. It's a 6-3 ball game. AKG, the 20-year-old from the Bronx. There he is, the baby-faced assassin, six feet seven. Tallest guy in Madden that I know of. Actually, there's a guy that plays for Maryland, Kaus. Kaus, he's pretty tall, but I think KG might be, AKG might be an inch taller. AKG, the first person to know when it's raining. <laughs> Second and one, and there's the pressure by AKG. Look, if you're, if you're young ice. A loss of nine. How many lives do you have? You can't <laughs> think that you're a cat and going to keep continue to get out of this hole, right? Well, well, now the pressure, the defense is motivated. They're coming off the ball, and now you don't have as much time. He's bringing a blitz off the right side. 
One-on-one coverage. He's got oh. Hilton Team. down the middle. Why? Down Hilton. inside the 20. What a pass there on the post route. Team. Coming Why? out of that gun bunch. You live by the blitz, you die by the blitz. There is the replay. We'll remix it, rehash it for you. And look at T.Y. Hilton from FIU doing great things for ice on his team. And we've got the gun bunch. Offset Coleman back. offset to the left-hand side. Absolutely digs. One-on-one -on -one coverage backside. Sinks to front. Boss to the right. Looking for the edge. Oh, great sure play. Sure tackler right there with Krause. Krause. The moon face mask right there. Krause looking a little sleepy, man. Look, a couple bags under the eye. If you're ice, you're in great, great shape right here. Oh. Be careful. Oh, almost picked off. Tipped by <laughs> Anthony Barr. One of the great linebackers in all of Madden. Oh, he tried to fit. He's, play, he's playing with fire. Almost had that user pick right there. Oh. Now if you're ice, you don't look at the clock. You're like, let me just score. Yeah. And if anything, I've got to get three here. Uh, uh, Third and eight again. from inside the red zone. And he's, he's got, got a him. shot right over the middle. Richardson. Richardson. The diving catch. Nice little skinny post route. Oh. And ice. Jumps in front, takes the lead there. 9-6, pending the PAT. From where? From Thorpe, Pennsylvania. Jim Thorpe, PA. Say it with your chest, young man. <laughs> Say it with your chest. PAT up and good, and that was a critical extra point. 10-4 ball game, under 30 seconds left. The baby face. I don't know don't if I kick this ball. Ice. I don't know if I kick this ball deep. I do. AKG's got a lot of juice. I might have went with the sky kick. He's oh, a hell of a returner. There. But great tackle. How about Krause? Sure-handed tackler. Sure hands with the hands on the picks. That's why you see a lot of Madden competitive players in Mutt. Madden ultimate team. Go ahead and draft that guy. Here we go. He, he does have that man. Aaron Rodgers, he's been here before. You see the safeties backing up. You saw Krause and his other safety... Doing a great job. Ed Reed backing up. Don't want anything behind you. You'll give up all of that. Deshaun Jackson. AKG with the timeout there. He's got two more in his back pocket. If you're ice, you will give up 10, 15-yard passes all day long. You just don't want the big one to get you over the top. You got to believe that every competitor practices and prepares for this situation. Let's see if his preparation meets his opportunity or just let's call it luck. AKG. With the ball, first and 10 at his own 40-yard line, trailing by four points. First and 10, he's got Aaron Rodgers, and he's going across the middle. Tyreek Hill at midfield. That's only a game of about 10 or 11, and it took six seconds off the clock. If you're ice, you give that up every day of the week. He did not look deep. He had to bang eight. He just didn't see it. It was sure coming did. open. At this point, you got to anticipate the throw. Aaron Rodgers. Pressure's coming. Oh, oh gets just get it him. away. Nine seconds. Yep. Ice from Jim Thorpe, PA, is knocking on the door for the championship. This could be our first upset. My palms are sweaty. Mom's spaghetti. <laughs> Speaking of spaghetti, how about the young kid? Ice with dripping with swagoo. On the nerves. He's on the going deep for Deshaun Jackson. Knocked down. One, one second left. One second to go. Still one second left for AKG. He's going to have to go deep again. This time, I don't think you go with Deshaun Jackson. You got to go with one of your bigger receivers. The problem is, AKG doesn't have a big receiver. Do you bring the Richardson, pressure? Hill and Deshaun Jackson. He's got a bunch of Smurfs out there. Third down and 10. He's going to have to look oh! up. He's brought down. Exclamation point. Will do it. Exclamation point. Hashtag my house. Don't care about ice. I don't care about AKG anymore. The youngster from Jim Thorpe, PA, 18 years of age, George Schwartz. He moves on to the Madden 18 Jets Championship wow. presented by Reach NJ. What a game that was. He gets the touchdown with under a minute to play, and he hangs on, and he's into the final against Franchise. That's going to be a good matchup right there. Why? Wow. That's exciting. My palms are sweating for real. I, 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 I don't want to touch you that you feel how clammy they are, but trust me, take my I, word I'm for it. I'm not going to feel them. I'm going to take your <laughs> word for it.
Larry Ridley here with Bart Scott, the mad backer, the former Jet. Great, can't wait. Oh, man, you've seen two great games, and we have a really good final coming up. What were you really impressed by when you looked at Young Ice? what he was able to do defensively on that last possession. A lot of pressure on him to show up. Well, I tell you what, I mean, all the pressure was on AKG, but you talk about before that, you know, him having a composure because AKG was starting to get into his head. He was starting to show his swag and I trying to intimidate him, and he was right back with it. He wasn't taking an inch. He was able to toe the line, and I mean, coming up with the big plays, huge. Huge upset, a huge win. Ice getting the win over AKG. And speaking of Ice, he is standing by now third member of our crew, EA, Eric Allen. Take it away, bud. Thanks, Larry. Well, Ice just told me just another day at the office. Ice water in the veins, huh? Yeah. Too easy. Too easy? Come on. Uh, obviously, tell me about that last drive. Down 6-3. to three. You need a score, and you get the touchdown on the skinny post. Uh, yeah, I was never, never in doubt. I knew I was going to win the whole time. Confidence is key. Like, I'm winning the next game and I'm going to Orlando. Where does that confidence come from, Ice? I don't know. I'm just confident. Yep. What about franchise? Now, this is it's all about Orlando. Who's going to represent the Jets down in Orlando? Give me a scouting report. Uh, he's a pretty good player. He's a good guy, but I just think I'm going to win. Hey, Bart, you got to like this guy. Doesn't have much to say. He's all business. And he says, I'm going to get it done. So we'll have to see what happens. Back to you guys up at the desk. I, I feel like I feel like